Hello friends, in this problem you have been given an equation and you have to solve for x and the equation is 1 divided by x square plus x plus 1 plus 1 divided by x square minus x plus 1 and this is equals to 1 by x. Then what is the value of x that satisfies this equation? Now how will you solve this problem? You may consider taking LCM and then expanding and then try to solve this problem. But basically if you start taking LCM then this will become a power 4. So that will increase the power. So we will try to solve this problem by reducing the power. Let us see how we can do that. So we have 1 by x square plus x plus 1 and plus 1 divided by x square minus x plus 1 this is equals to 1 by x. Now let us multiply throughout by x. So this will be x divided by this will be x divided by and this will also be x divided by. So we will have x divided by x square plus x plus 1 plus x divided by x square minus x plus 1 this is equals to 1. Now once again we can divide numerator and denominator by x. So in this case numerator will become simply 1 and denominator will be x square plus x plus 1 divided by x and here I will have 1 divided by x square minus x plus 1 and this divided by x and this is equals to 1. So this is equals to 1. Now let us divide by x. So this becomes, so let me write this side. So this becomes 1 divided by x square by x is simply x, x by x is 1 and 1 by x is 1 by x. And here you will have 1 divided by x minus 1 plus 1 by x and this is equals to 1. Now I can make a substitution here that is y is equals to x plus 1 by x. Now with this substitution what you have the first term is x plus 1 by x plus 1 and the second term is x plus 1 by x minus 1 this is equals to 1. So this becomes 1 divided by y plus 1 and this becomes 1 divided by y minus 1 this is equals to 1. Now I can take the LCM so this is y plus 1 times y minus 1 and this side will have 1 and this is y minus 1 plus y plus 1. So 1 cancels out so you will have 2 by and this is y plus 1 into y minus 1 that is y square minus 1 is equals to 1. So here I have used the formula that is a plus b times a minus b this is equals to a square minus b square. So that is y plus 1 into y minus 1 is equals to y square minus 1. So now I will have 2 by is equals to y square minus 1. Now let us take everything to the left. So this will become or let us take everything to the right. So this is 0 is equals to y square minus 2 by minus 1. So this is quadratic in y. I can solve this equation. So this is y square minus 2 by minus 1 is equals to 0. And if you remember if you have a quadratic equation ax square plus bx plus c is equals to 0 then roots of this equation is minus b plus minus b square minus 4ac under the square root and divided by 2a. So if I use this formula then y will be b is minus 2 so this becomes plus 2 plus minus 4 and this is minus minus plus 4ac divided by 2a. So this is 2 plus minus root 8 that is 2 root 2 divided by 2. So this is basically 2 plus minus root 2. 
So, this is 1 plus minus root 2. So, two condition you can have that is either we can have y is equals to 1 plus root 2 that is one situation or y is equals to 1 minus root 2. So, let us consider these two cases and y is what if you remember y is x plus 1 by x. Now, I can consider case 1 that is y is equals to 1 plus root 2. So, in this case this becomes y is basically x plus 1 by x is equals to 1 plus root 2. So, this becomes if I multiply throughout by x this is x square plus 1 is equals to 1 plus root 2 times x. Now, I can take this to the left hand side. So, this is x square minus 1 plus root 2 x minus 1 is equals to 0. So, what is x? So, again minus b. So, this becomes root 2 plus 1 plus minus b square that is root 2 plus 1 whole square and minus 4 a c and this divided by 2. So, from here I can solve for x. So, x is equals to root 2 plus 1 plus minus this is 2 plus 1 plus 2 root 2 plus 4 divided by 2. So, x is equals to root 2 plus 1 plus minus 4 plus 2 6 plus 1 7 a square root 7 plus 2 root 2 and this divided by 2. So, basically there will be a plus. So, this I made a mistake. So, this was plus 1 and I put somewhere is minus 1. So, this is plus 1. So, this will be minus 4 and then here also minus 4. So, 2 plus 3 minus 4 is nothing but minus 1. So, this will be minus 1 here. So, in this case the x value is root 2 plus 1 plus minus a square root 2 root 2 minus 1 divided by 2. So, two values and both will be real in this case. Now, let us discuss the second case. In this case y is equals to so case 2 in this case y is equals to 1 minus root 2 and y is x plus 1 by x and this is equals to 1 minus root 2. So, let us solve again you can multiply by x. So, this becomes a quadratic x square plus 1 is equals to 1 minus root 2 times x and let us take this to the left hand side. So, this becomes x square minus 1 minus root 2 x plus 1 this is equals to 0. Now, I can write this as x square plus root 2 minus 1 times x plus 1 is equals to 0. So, x will be minus b. So, minus of root 2 minus 1 plus minus b a square under the square root that is root 2 minus 1 whole square minus 4 a c divided by 2. So, now in this case we will have x is equals to minus. So, this becomes 1 minus root 2 plus minus this is 2 plus 1 minus 2 root 2 minus 4 and this divided by 2. So, x is equals to 1 minus root 2 plus minus this is a square root minus 1 minus 2 root 2 divided by 2. So, in this case the two roots are complex. So, I can say in this case x is equals to 1 minus root 2 plus minus I can take minus root minus 1 as a root common. So, this becomes 1 plus 2 root 2 and divided by 2 and minus root of minus 1 is nothing but i complex number iota. So, in this case we have two complex roots. So, these are the two complex root and these are the two real roots for this equation. So, I hope this video was useful for you and if you like these videos please share with your friends like on my channel and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.